Well, obviously, science has grown enormously over the past 500 years, and we now understand vastly more about how the natural world works. And that does have a tendency, perhaps, to lead people to depend on science and on technology for their safety and for their food supplies and for their health and so on and so forth. So there is a sense in which today it's natural enough that modern people tend to depend upon science for a lot of things that in the past were completely out of people's control and all they could do was pray about it. Um, but the more fundamental question is, has science displaced or has it, has it ruled out uh, a faithful stance? And I would give the definite answer that that's clearly can't be the case. I mean, in the first place, the early scientists, those scientists who were responsible for the scientific revolu revolution, were predominantly Christian people. Certainly for them, science adopting uh, the, an understanding of the natural world based on explaining nature naturally did not replace their faith. It, it supplemented it. it. It helped it in many respects. And I think that's actually also been the case um, that I've seen in my interactions with people in universities and so forth. Actually, if you ask who are the Christians in universities, you find that actually scientists are not underrepresented amongst Christians in the university. They're actually, if anything, overrepresented. It's, it's the scientists that tend to be the Christians, and it's the sociologists and, and politicians and, and humanists, um, people in the humanities, who tend, who tend less to be um, Christians. So I think that the, the impression that many people have got that science somehow is so incompatible with Christianity, with spiritual view of the world, um, is simply um, a mistake. It just isn't the, the case factually. Whether it should be or not uh, is a much bigger question, but I certainly think that, and this is the title of my book, that a scientist can believe in miracles, can believe in a God who acts in the world, um, and I certainly do.